today's episode on roads going with the Cummins, we are going to the Buffalo Bill Center of the West. That looks good. It smells good. Located in Cody, Wyoming, and about an hour east of Yellowstone, you'll find the Buffalo Bill Center of the West. My research began at their website. There you'll find a free digital trip planning guide, information on each of the individual museums, operation hours, costs, and so much more. You'll even find information on how to do a virtual field trip. My favorite part of the website was the Family Activities at the Center of the West page. There I found information on summer workshops, winter workshops, family fun days, and several art projects to incorporate into your studies. The website was definitely a great place to begin my research and found activities for all different age levels. What should you know? There are five different museums. The Buffalo Bill Museum, Cody Firearms Museum, the Whitney Western Art Museum, Draper National History Museum, and our favorite, the Plains Indian Museum. Grace, where are we going? To the Plains Indian Museum. Why are we doing that? Because this was first on our scavenger hunt, and when you finish the scavenger hunt, you can get um, rewards, yeah. All right, well, let's go to the scavenger hunt so we can get our special surprise. We definitely recommend picking up one of the scavenger hunts as the kids really enjoyed this activity. So who is this guy and how do we know him? Pre He's President, President Roosevelt, the Knight of the Museum. <laughs> we know who this guy is from Knight of the Museum. That's pretty, that's a pretty good movie if you actually remembered something from it. Uh -huh. After reviewing each of their scavenger hunts, the kids earned a sticker for each of the museums completed. Cool. One thing that you really liked today? The rocks. Mine was probably that we got to do a scavenger hunt and we got to look for certain type of things and still learn about stuff. And I thought that was really cool and we still got to learn and have fun. That was Good. probably my favorite thing. All the animals. You like the animals and the nature exhibit? Yeah. Awesome. The museum was awesome. There is so much to see. There's five different museums in there. It doesn't look that big. It looks kind of big, but most of it's like underground. Yeah. And so there was a ton more in there there's than like, we thought there was going to be. There's like three stories. So I had read on the website that they suggest that you give approximately like two days. Right. Um, we did not do that. Yeah. We crammed it all in one day, and thus we have two kids that are somewhat, one kid that's super cranky by now. Yep. Uh, and the other one is definitely done for the day, and then we have a trooper who is filming for us right now, which we appreciate. So. Uh, but it was great. So um, they have a scavenger hunt 
and I found it on the website, and I actually printed out because that's what it said to do. Yep. Um, but it turns out the one on the website is old. Some of the exhibits aren't even up anymore, which is why we have such a hard time finding some of them. But they actually have them printed out, so just ask when you go in, um, and they'll direct you to where they are. Yeah, so uh, really cool thing, the, the raptors. Yeah. They have live raptors. There's 12 different birds here. Yeah. They so bring them out. Don't miss that presentation. It happens like three times yeah, a day. Yeah, for sure. That was really cool, really informative. The guy was funny. Yes. Uh, learned a ton. Uh, the they have thing, a place to eat in here, which I have to say was decently yeah. priced and good food. Yeah, the food uh, was really good. I had a buffalo burger. Yeah. It was delicious. They had a salad bar. We had a salad bar. Kennedy and I were super happy with that. Um, anytime the kids don't complain when we go somewhere about the food, it must be like good food. So um, it was decently priced. Yeah. Yeah, so I mean, we'll give that two thumbs up for sure. Yeah. What else? I don't know. They're, I, the pass gets you in for two days. Yes. So you buy one ticket, you get in for two days. So you don't have to rush. It's just we waited to the last minute of being here. Because we're leaving tomorrow. So we had to fit it all in today. Yeah. But um, I and mean, I, it was one of the nicest museums we've ever been in. Yeah. So they're partnership with the Smithsonian. So it's Smithsonian quality in there. Um, and then the other thing I'll tell you, they had some outside stuff, and I don't know if that stuff's open in the winter time. Um, but we didn't even do the outside stuff today because. <laughs> There's just so much There's stuff to There's so see. much to do. So, um, and as I mentioned, we got cranky kids at this point because we've been here since I mean, nine early. something this morning. Yeah. Yeah, and it's four o'clock. It's been a long day, so. Yeah. Um, but this is definitely an awesome museum. Don't miss it when you come. Great educational opportunities, definitely. Um, yep, so check out the Buffalo Bill Center of the West. All right, thanks for watching. Don't forget to give us a like. And if you're not a subscriber, go ahead and subscribe. Thank you. Thanks, guys.